E. It's not wasting more time with this video. I don't want to split it up either. So that's one of the problems I was facing with making this guide. I don't know whether I should split the video. There's a boat over here. That's going to be a lot easier. I know why that. Because I would have to split it up a lot or... Oh shit, that's a jet ski. That's not a boat. Very nice. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. This is just gonna make travel a ton easier. Alright. Because I don't know whether I should break up the quest or just keep doing a playthrough showing you where I go, everything I do. And that's why I said I'll maybe I'll do the playlist, but it's gonna take a ton of time and I don't know how these are gonna turn out yet either. Oh, we're on land. Which means we've made it. This car over here. Is there a fort over here somewhere? Oh, there's a Yeah, let's go get that radio tower. Why not? It's right there. It's right there, why not? Go pop on it real quick. As you can see, I have a short attention span. But that is one of the great things about this game, which is why I love it so much, is how huge this map is, how much stuff there is to do, even though radio towers and taking out pirate camps are kind of... can get repetitive after a while, I see. But, you know, whatever. It's not that big of a deal. Alright, how do we get up there? Oh, all right. Here we go. Whenever you see these vines hanging off, they'll be—they can be ropes too. They—you can climb up on top of them. Right, there. Eventually, these radio towers are going to become harder. They're just mini platform sections, so right now they're not too difficult, but eventually they can be a pain in the ass. I'm kind of having fun playing through this right now, recording, just having a little fun. Hopefully a lot of people will enjoy this. Maybe they will, maybe they won't. Uh, like I said in the previous video, I'm not sure if Caleb wants to record with me. I wouldn't want him to be spoiled on the game since he is going to purchase it. I let him play this a little bit. And he enjoyed it, so I don't know. We'll have to see what happens. Do I think make this a mini game? Like uh, in Bioshock when you hack the turrets, that was fun. I'm thinking about doing a playthrough of Planescape Torment or Icewind Dale, uploading that onto my channel as well. Since I really, really enjoy those games, those are fantastic titles. But we'll just have to see where it goes, I guess. Temple of Stone up there, another supply drop quest, a bunch of animals. Let's keep heading over towards Dr. Reinhardt. Oh, he's all the way up there. Alright. There's a tattoo. It gets bigger and bigger. We get more inked up along the... as the game progresses and as we upgrade more and more skills. Uh, fishing... fetish net. I think that's what that said. That's pretty weird. Uh, is that a jet ski over there? Oh yeah! Give me that jet ski! Even though we're only gonna go across the bank here. Yes, I love the jet ski. All right. He's all the way up on the top of that. This guy is a. This guy's a real character. He's probably my favorite. Well, no, he's not my favorite. He's my second favorite. My favorite is probably Sam, who we meet later on in the game. We'll have to see what happens with him. $62, very nice. My wallet's probably about to be full. I can only carry a thousand with me right now. So I'll probably have to go hunting pretty soon to upgrade it as well. All right. Climb and climb and climb and climb and climb and climb. 
Nothing of importance. Animals. Alright, here we go. I think I'm going to lower my weapon once I walk back here. Nope, not yet. Eventually you do, that means you're never going to fight in here because he doesn't want you to kill NPCs. I have to say, this guy's got a pretty, pretty chill house living up here. Yeah, a little plant, that's nice. He's got a pretty, he's got a chill, uh, chill crib up here. He's got a pretty nice, uh, pretty nice digs. A little waterfall. Animals to hunt. I don't, it's not a bad place. Scaffolding, he's obviously doing some work. Some drugs. Why, she's in my house, good sir. Where else should we be? Completely messed that up. Meant to say where else would she be. My FOV is all the way out, by the way. That's why I keep zooming out. Because a big FOV is better. Jason Rambo Brody's on the case. And that, my good sirs, is it for this video. I will see you in the next one when we do the quest Mushrooms in the Deep. Thank you for watching, and goodbye.